Hello everyone, welcome to the IchimokuCharts.com daily analysis for the Euro US dollar FX for Monday, December 3rd, 2012. Well, a continuation of the trend to the upside today, and the candle has made a higher high and a higher low, and a fairly large white body candle. The size of the body on this candle is very much larger than the previous three trading days. And where the uh, buyers are only making a very small amount of net bullish progress on the day between the open and the close, today they've really uh, been quite strong and uh, have shown some really good uh, solid upside momentum. We have had the uh, buyers uh, uh, take control of this market. Uh, they have closed up above the midpoint level, but not quite at the high. We can see that the buyers did lose some commitment at the important resistance of 130.79. It was an important level that's been tested before as strong resistance and some price rejection there today. And it does raise some doubt about continuation of the trend. Uh, it will be an important area that we do need to watch t tomorrow. There is a good chance that the market will break that area, but uh, it still does need to be watched very carefully. Uh, we also have potentially strong support at the 130.25 and then very strong support down here at the uh, top of the cloud just below there at 129.90. Now, a very significant event today. If we look at the previous one, two, three, four, five of six trading days, this market tested either to the top of the cloud or just outside of the top of the cloud and was strongly rejected from there. So the buyers were constantly losing commitment over the last week from that area today. Very significant, a solid bullish breakout up above the cloud. So we now have a bullish market in big pitch terms, and it's been some time since the market was bullish in the long term time frame, and we've done that on a fairly bullish candle. So it does suggest that there is strong potential for this market to trend higher. Now the only problem is though we have strong resistance overhead, and not only the 130.79 level, but also this swing high at 131.45, and then the zone here extending up to 131.96 roughly that 132 level very very strong resistance overhead so even though we have this solid bullish move by the market today because of this strong resistance there is some doubt about how far this market will actually appreciate but uh, this is a signal with Ichimoku charts it is a strong signal with this breakout up above the uh, cloud and uh, we really do need to watch the 130.79 level now just looking at the uh, current Fibonacci extension, we're examining the first time frame uptrend and its relationship to the previous time the market was trending up. And here, uh, previously we saw the market finding resistance around the 38.2% level, very indecisive trading where the uh, buyers were losing commitment up above the cloud as well, and the 38.2% the level coincided just with the top of the cloud. Here today the market's been bullish enough to take out that 38.2% and the 50% in a bullish manner but we traded exactly to the 61.8% and was rejected from there. So that does raise some doubt about continuation of this trend to the upside so we do need to be very careful about tomorrow's candle. If we see a weak candle and we see selling coming in early in the trading day then there is potential for this market to re to retrace back towards the uh, top of the cloud and potentially find support either at the top of the cloud or just within the uh, area around the uh, around the top. So there is a strong potential for a change of trend based on that but certainly the sellers have not taken control of this market so the indication is only based on the uh, Fibonacci ratio not on the short-term dynamics. Now in terms of the Fibonacci retracement of the prior downtrend now that we're in an uptrend we had the bullish breakout up above the 100% level for today's trading. Previous two trading days again as with the other Fibonacci technique we had the uh, tests up above the important level, in this case the 100% level and the strong price rejection, it suggested there was possibility of a change of trend, but today the momentum has swung to the buyers with this bullish breakout above the 100%. This market is almost tested to the 161.8% today at 130.87, so there is potential for the market to test to that level for today's trading, it is a target. Uh, for tomorrow's trading, sorry, and if we do see the sellers start to come into the market up around that level, then that might suggest that there is potential for a change of trend. If we do see bullish activity continuing up through that level, then we do have uh, an area at 132.16, which is at the 261.8% that will give us a target to watch for, but certainly with these strong areas of resistance overhead, uh, there is some doubt about whether the market will make the 261.8%. 
Now in terms of Ichimoku, we now have a bullish market in all three time frames and that does suggest that this market is destined for higher levels. We had the bullish breakout up above the cloud, a bullish signal with Ichimoku. We also have the market trading above the Kijun Sen, the pink line and the Tenkan Sen, so the market is bullish in the medium and fast term time frames. And the Chikou span here is above the corresponding price action, so it's giving a confirmation of all of these bullish signals suggesting that there is a strong potential for the market to trade higher. But Let's watch how the market approaches 130.79 for tomorrow's trading. If we see strong bullish activity testing up through that level, then a good possibility we could quickly be testing to 131.45.